And we come to the weight and the total. So in the previous total, we have discussed with uh, what is the use of uh, XML files in uh, uh, unnet projects. Uh, okay, so here uh, XML files are used to create views actually. So I have told you already in uh, previous tutorials. So it is also possible to create uh, views of front end in uh, Java files also. Okay. Instead of uh, using this uh, .level main, you can directly set uh, the component uh, or the code components uh, into a set to content view. Okay. So you can see that example, a simple example right now. So I can go for, uh, I can put comment to this one. Okay. So right now, over here, I'm going to uh, use a text view, tv equals to new text view. Okay. So TV, I uh, can put this to this. Okay, so TV means what happens? So we are creating uh, one uh, text view here. Okay, so we need to import this uh, text view which was there in under that would get uh, package. And uh, the next is uh, I can go to set one text to this one TV dot uh, set text. Okay, so TV dot uh, sorry. Okay, TV dot set text. Uh, I will set to this uh, text to someone now. Since or yeah, within the double code, I can give hello, welcome to the yeah. hello, welcome to the world of Android. Okay, so so I can give this some exclamation here. Okay, see this is the statement that need to be displayed in uh, text view. Okay. So after this, uh, I can set this content view to so r dot layout dot main. I can give this one. Okay, directly to the TV text view. Okay, let's save this. So after saving this, see what happens in this uh, application. So whenever the startup is created, I mean so activity is created, what happens? So it is going to call on create. So on create will be having the variable of uh, Text view means so object is created here. So that object will be set with a text that is called hello, welcome to the world of Android. Okay. And so we are setting that uh, content view or that text view. Okay. See, I just run this application. Right. Alright, look at the output. Okay, hello, welcome to the world of Android. Okay, so we got that uh, output. So it's uh, this uh, startup file is not going to use any main.xml or any XML files. Okay, we are directly creating uh, our views using uh, the inbuilt uh, classes of uh, the Android package. So that views will be set to some text and uh, we are setting that content view to that view. Okay, so if we have more, more than one uh, kind of Controls we are we need to follow different procedures so in the Java applications itself. Okay, so it is also so it uh, con the conclusion is uh, so this is also possible to create views in in the Java applications also in uh, Android. Okay, so how this program executes we can see in the next next tutorial. Okay, so so means uh, what I am going to tell is uh, how the startup executes. Okay, so we are executing uh, the startup over here. But what are the procedures will be taken now while executing the, this startup? Okay, by the Eclipse over here. Okay, so we can discuss with uh, that uh, execution procedure of this startup in the next uh, next tutorial. So that is with uh, Android manifest.xml file. Okay, so what is this uh, manifest.xml file and uh, how it will how it will uh, uh, take place in my applications uh, Android applications? We can see that in the next tutorial. Thanks for watching this tutorial.